Hello there. Once again, this is Anton from Antonimo Bay. Um, taking a look at some comics that I've slowly but surely been putting together a run of. And I don't have a lot, but I'm going to show you what I got because they're good stuff. Our special guest action figures today are Medusa and uh, Spider Woman. I'm trying to think. Jessica Drew, Spider Woman. Um, and today we're going to be looking at Marvel Comics Presents. Um, these things, you will find them in bargain bins, kind of everywhere. Um, they contain small stories, or uh, I should say short stories. But they'll have like three of them going at a time. Let me see. Yep, that's a flip over cover. And you'll, you'll get a lot of like obscure, offbeat side stories that, you know, you wouldn't normally see in a comic book. You wouldn't normally see in Wolverine, you know, like, uh, oh, by the way, a lot of them for a while had this flip over deal where it would highlight Wolverine with also in this, the young gods, but flip it over and you've got, um, Sam Keith drawing Ghost Rider and that's amazing. I love the way Sam Keith draws, um, which is great stuff. Flip that guy over. You've got issue 20. Issue 5, that's one I recently acquired in a lot of stuff. Issue 6. Issue 32. Um, 77. No, nope, didn't do the flip overs yet. I think it's mostly in the early 100s that they started doing the um, dual flip covers. And I thought they were, I thought that was just fantastic. Um, there's another Sam Keith Ghost Rider. Um, a lot of Wolverine short stories, a lot of Typhoid Mary short stories. I know he's noticed a lot of Ghost Rider. There's Wolverine. Flip it over, you get Iron Man, or Iron Fist, uh, Cage, Ghost Rider. Just little short stories of those characters. And some of them were so good. Um, I really enjoyed them. Especially some of the short Wolverine stories. Just a side of Wolverine that you don't always see. Um, it's a flip cover. More Ghost Rider. Um, Shadow Cat. Um, there's a Barry Windsor Smith cover. Some people really like Barry Windsor Smith art. I am not one of them. Um, I don't want to rag on the guy. I'm not. I'm just not a huge fan. To me, this looks like um, beef jerky Wolverine. He looks dehydrated. It's kind of to me. Every time I see Barry Windsor Smith's art, that's what I think of. Is like it just looks like you took this superhero and dried him out. I don't know. It's just my thoughts. Um, I know he's a popular artist. Okay, here's another and. This is probably another divisive thing. Most people don't like Sam Keith um, quite so much as I do. But Sam Keith Wolverine is just fantastic. Sam Keith, uh, uh, this Doctor Strange, he looks like Mr. Gone. Fantastic art. I just love the way he renders stuff. In such a, such a wacky way. Um, there's a She-Hulk and Wolverine. More Ghost Rider. Some Colossus. I think that's a duplicate. I think I already had that one up. Um, another great story with Cyclops. Um, you've got Wolf, or another uh, Ghost Rider at, with his Sam Keith style feet. That's just how he drew everything. But I absolutely love the way he draws um, Wolverine. And this looks like Julie from the Max. It's everything. It just looks like it's straight out of the Max comic because it's such... A peculiar stylized style um, anyway if you guys if you've never heard of Marvel Comics presents check them out they should be relatively easy to find um, just little backside issues that you can find out of bargain bins and stuff like that pick them up if you see them they're good stuff that's my story and I'll catch you later